Hello ladies, it is I, Mr. Essential. Today I am coming at you from lovely Las Vegas, Nevada, Sin City. Why am I here, you ask? Well, the folks at the Venetian Resort sent me a free stay in one of their suites. And I work for an airline, so I was able to fly here without paying airfare. So, except for going out to eat a couple times, it has been a very inexpensive trip, might I say. Anyway, enough about that. I'll make another post, a long post, about my fabulous stay here in Nevada. But first, I have a very short We'll call this a public service announcement. It involves private property rights and the Rona and masks. It's pretty straightforward. If you are in a privately owned facility, okay, and they say you must wear a mask, you must wear a mask. You don't have an argument. You don't have a pot to piss in. Why? Because they own or lease that building, which means property taxes are being paid on that facility also if you're in a store they bought all that merchandise that's sitting there they already paid for it they're waiting for you to buy it that's when they make money on it they've got a staff that they've got to protect and they may just be doing it to avoid lawsuits it doesn't matter what their reason is what matters is they have a private property right to demand that you wear a mask due to the current situation okay so you have choices you can suck it up and wear a mask or you can go someplace else now I hear your complaints already but mr. essential every place demands I wear a mask so what you can go online and get most things you can order your groceries and have them delivered to you curbside and you know what if you order your groceries and have them delivered to you curbside you don't make impulse purchases and get that 48 pack of chocolate chip cookies that are helping you gain weight you know you just get what you need anyway they have an absolute right to ask you to wear a mask on their private property likewise if you take an uber and the driver says put on a mask it's their car not yours put on a mask here's the flip side to that though if you invite people over to your house you can tell them or your apartment you can tell them my place is a mask free zone I will insist that you remove your mask upon entry and I will not tolerate if you ask me to put on a mask when you get there. If you can't abide those rules, don't come over. Likewise, if you offer to give somebody a lift, you can say, this is my car, take off your mask. If they refuse, don't give them a ride. It cuts both ways. Private property rights in the long term are going to be more important. We need to protect those private property rights in the long term more than we need to worry about the Rona in the short term so if a business says wear a mask put the damn mask on if somebody comes over and says I don't want to take my mask off and you want them to ask them to leave it's pretty simple anyway that's all I got for now I will have another post hopefully a much funnier post later but in the meantime you know, do your yoga, drink some orange juice, uh, get out, get some sun, except, of course, if you're in Nevada, because it was 84 degrees at 4 o'clock in the morning. <sighs> so, but anyway, no matter what, I still love all y'all, no matter what your opinion on masks is. And uh, love you. Later. Bye.